what's up guys, Wild and Customs here and today we're going to take a look at the BGE9 Canon battery grip for the Canon 60D. If you guys know, I bought the Zyko's battery grip over the weekend, I have a video up for that if you want to ch check that out. I was impressed by the product, however I wasn't satisfied with it. A couple problems about it, um, you know, it still was 100 bucks also so I felt like I could shell out an extra 75 and get the original EOS version. So let's take a look at it. The link for the Zykos will be at the end if anyone's interested. But right now, let's take a look in the box. We got here. We have a cloth. What is this? Oh, it's a bag. That's pretty cool. So we got a Canon bag here. It looks like for the, I'm guessing, for one of the cartridges for the batteries. Next we have the <clears throat> got a cartridge for the cannon battery, pretty cool. We got it here. Manual. Warranty. And well, I gotta say these the packaging is a lot better than this than the Zyko's. And here's the grip. <clears throat> For one thing, I noticed already the uh, this Canon grip is a lot. I don't say heavier, but yeah, I guess it's a little bit heavier. Definitely feels a lot more solid. Feels like a Canon camera, also. So that's pretty nice. Uh, let's take some look, nice shots of it up close. Overall, the plastic and the surface of this looks a lot cleaner. Definitely a lot looks a lot looks a lot like the Canon 60D also. All right. All right, guys. So before I install the battery grip, I want to talk about what a lot of you are thinking probably: Why spend so much money on this when I could have bought the cheaper version? And I actually had the cheaper version uh, from third parties. Um, the thing is that the Zyko's version was really nice definitely felt great it was a really good duplicate exactly the same however after even touching this for a little bit I f definitely sense the difference between the two this definitely feels a lot better you have to actually hold this in your hand to understand that definitely all over it feels really nice a lot more solid definitely I actually had the Zyko's version in my hand before and I was squeezing it you can actually hear the plastic you know, if you put a lot, enough grip on it, you can actually hear it like kind of crack or give a little bit. Like this, definitely you don't. The build quality in this is a lot nicer. I have to give you that. And definitely feels a lot nicer also. Definitely feels like a Canon 6D all over. And believe me, I used to have the 550D, uh, 500D, and I had a Zyko's battery grip, and that worked fine. But I'm, I don't know, maybe the 6D might, might be an exception because I bought the Zykos one and I didn't think it was worth it and I'd rather go all the way instead of buying a cheap one so there you go alright guys to install the battery grip first off we're going to take this off we're also going to take out the cartridge which should be the double A's yes they are take your 60D take out the battery and cover I'm going to put the six the cover on the wow that just slid in a lot easier. Then we're going to take the six D place it on top. We're going to screw it in. And for your guys' information, there is a little bit of give still in the wheel, but it's not as bad as the Zyko's version because the Zyko's version 
was a lot more wobbly, it wobbled a lot more. Um, also, you could in the Zygos version, you actually saw the gaps on top and bottom, where to the fact that you could see your hand, your finger through the other side. This one is a lot more solid, I have to say, to the fact where I really don't care anymore. <laughs> and uh, it's not that bad. All right, take the battery. In. There you go. Let's turn it on. Works. Nice. Alright, guys, now we're going to take some sample shots. Got the 50 on. Going to use the grip shutter button. Feels nice. Alright, now we're going to preview that. I'm going to zoom in using the grip buttons and zoom out. The buttons feel really nice, really s solid and clicky. It's a really good thing. And that's about it. So, basically, guys, it's all about, you know, it's really all up to you guys what you guys want to spend money on. And to tell you the truth, the third party brand Zykos one I had was pretty good. I'm not going to lie. It could, I, you know, if I really didn't want to pay extra money, I would have kept it, but that's just me, you know. It felt okay, it felt good, it worked. It just in the back of my mind, it's like, you know, I, I, I'm pretty sure that the, I'm spending 100 bucks already. I spent a little bit more, I could get a better version, and a one that fused a lot better. So that's why I bought this one, and between the two of them, there's a big leap in quality with this one. This is so much better. It feels a lot more tougher and solid. Like when I had the Zykos version and I had, to had it attached to my 6CD, I felt like I was ho holding a camera with an attachment on the bottom all the time. Even though it was, you know, it was nicely tight on, you know, that's how I felt like because the difference in quality of the plastics and the materials. However, when I have this on and this and this battery grip on, this feels a lot more solid. It feels like a whole camera, like it's fused together. You know, you, you really have to just feel it yourself to understand that. And like, this definitely feels a lot better now. I'm actually really happy. I'm gonna stick with this one. But you know, you never know. Some people might not really care that much. I'm pretty sure there'll be people out there who don't mind buying the third party brands. That's fine. To each his own. You know, I, I believe me, I had the 500D version of the Zyko script. I had had it for almost two years. I had no problems with it, but I don't know. It might. It looks like the 6CD version isn't as good, I guess, to me, any, if anything. And plus, the 6CD version of the Zyko script was a lot more expensive than the 500D, almost uh, 50 bucks more. So, yeah, that's justifying my reasons to buy this. So that's about it, guys. Definitely, you know, check this one out. I think you'd be more happy with this. Quality is a lot better. The build quality is a lot nicer. It feels a lot more sturdier. It definitely feels like a monster of a camera now. And also, the accessories of the grip are a lot nicer too. You know, this one you get a bag, which is really nice. Also, the double A cartridge is really nicely built. It feels a lot more sturdier, definitely. Everything feels a lot more solid. And you look closely here. You get nice rubber grips in the inside to hold the batteries in. You know, the small things like that make up and add up definitely. Definitely like this whole part feels a lot more like a 6CD. Even this is a lot more smoother. Just a lot of things to add up. Definitely also when I was putting the grip on, it felt like it went down more smoothly. You know, tighten up felt more smoothly. Even putting the cartridge in felt like it was more smooth, like it was meant to be there, and not like two pieces of plastic scraping against each other as it goes in. You know, there's a lot of small things that add up. So, like I said, it's always to each his own. You want to spend less money for something that will work, or more money for something that will work and will be more comfortable. So, that's about it, guys. Go check out the Zenko's review. You know, it might suit you better, or you might be fine with it. So, like I said, to each his own. You never know. So, until next time, guys. Thank you for watching. Like always, comment, criticize, subscribe. Do whatever you want. Just pay attention. And peace.